simple squamous epithelium or epithelial cells uh, held together in a sheet. This is a view from above. These are flat cells that are so thin that the nucleus actually bulges above them. But this is a membrane and uh, it's a couple of cells thick, so it's kind of hard to see exactly, but here you see the outline of these cells. So these are simple epithelial cells held together in a sheet or a tissue of simple squamous epithelium. When we talk about cell junctions, you might want to take a second peek at this uh, because this is stained to uh, show us those cell junctions. And you'll notice they're sort of intermittent here. That's called a desmosome. They work sort of like snaps or buttons on your clothes. They hold things together, but um, don't really zipper them uh, in. <clears throat> so that's it. Uh, you, this stain doesn't really show us a uh, nucleus very well. And so you might think of these as being just like the tiles that make up the tile floor. So take a look at the floor of the, our lab and you will see what looks pretty much like a simple squamous epithelium. Now let's take a look at the same thing from the side. I'm going to move back out. And whoa, uh, whoop, here we go. Uh, this <coughs> is our two blood vessels. This is a slice that contains two blood vessels surrounded by fat or adipose tissue. Uh, this is an artery or a small artery, so it's called an arterial. This is a small vein called a venule. Uh, you'll also see often traveling along with the artery in the vein. Uh, you'll see nerves, and that's what these little guys are. And so that's pretty cool to see those. All right, so let's zip up and take a closer look at these. Whoa, let's go over here. And when I zoom in on this arterial, uh, you'll notice this is smooth muscle around here. And then lining that, just this single layer of cells lining the lumen of this vessel is the simple squamous epithelium. And you can see the nuclei, these little dark dots that bulge into the inside of this vessel. Uh, this is a little bit of, <laughs> of a blood that still remains. But let's take a look at the vein. Yeah, here's that nerve. Um, yeah, oh, there's another nerve. Um, okay, so let's look at the same thing. This is lined by a single layer of these very thin, thin cells, simple squamous epithelial cells. And uh, the, what you're seeing is the nucleus bulging above the layer of the cytoplasm. So here's a nucleus, here's a nucleus, here's a nucleus, here's a nucleus, and then the cytoplasm is right around it. Where's a good uh, stretch? Maybe up in here. Um, so here's the cytoplasm, here's the cytoplasm, here's the cytoplasm, and there's uh, the nucleus that bulges above it. And that's all that lines the inside of people like this. Very easy to diffuse across. Ooh, isn't that one nice? You can kind of outline the whole thing. And this, again, has some uh, residual blood inside the vessel. So simple squamous epithelium. This is the view from the side, and this is the view from above.